This is my tutorial for a neutral falling leaves peekaboo tumbler. I have already sanded and prepped my tumbler with an 80 grit sanding block and white spray paint. Now we're ready for our glitter. I'll be applying my glitter using the epoxy method, but do whatever is easiest for you. First, let me apologize to all my summer loving subscribers, Patreon members, but my mind is on fall, fall leaves, crisp cool air, pumpkin sweatshirts, campfires, hay rides, all the fall things, and I am currently obsessed with looking at fall color palettes on Pinterest. Neutral colors are a favorite of mine, and if you look around my house and my wardrobe, you'll find nothing but neutral colors. So to start off my fall designs, I wanted to experiment with neutral colors. While you're glittering your tumbler, save the glitter that falls until you're absolutely finished glittering your tumbler. We'll be using that custom mix it makes on our tumblers for later. Let your glitter layer cure, epoxy till smooth, then we'll be ready to add our stencils. A while then you'll remember these leaves the leaves y'all you know the ones from this design that I made last year when I literally wanted to throw the tumbler out the window because of those stems yeah that one so be sure to cut them suckers off for placement I wanted most of my leaves to be at the top and towards the middle and with the bottom portion of the cup blank you'll see why in a bit Now that we're finished adding our stencils, we're ready to apply our spray paint. Apologies, but I neglected to film my first coat of spray paint, but I'm doing an ombre with the pewter gray at the bottom and then the glossy white at the top. When you're done, let your paint completely dry and pull your stencils.
Now to add the custom mix that we made from the cast off glitter from glittering our cups earlier. I wanted the feel of almost like leaves falling with most of the glitter being towards the bottom to kind of signify a pile of leaves, kind of just all at the bottom of the cup. Now normally I like to use chunkier glitters to do this, but I wanted to experiment with the finer glitters and I really like how it turned out. Now you might be wondering why I don't sprinkle the glitter on instead of doing it the way I'm doing it now. And I do it for a couple of reasons. One, it will save me an epoxy step by mixing the glitter into the leftover epoxy. And two, I have more control over where I want the glitter to go. I want more glitter on the bottom and less glitter on the top. With chunkier glitter, it would be easier to do by sprinkling it on, but with the finer glitter cuts, I find it easiest for me to add my glitter into my epoxy and do it this way. But do whatever makes you comfortable. When you're all done, let cure, then we'll be ready to add our outlines. Excuse the location change, my office became a hot mess while I was rushing to get ready for my group live that I did in my kitchen. I needed to add the outlines before the live started yesterday so I could epoxy right after the live was done or these tumblers would not have been finished in time for me to make this tutorial. Y'all, I started these tumblers on Wednesday. Wednesday. Your girl has been rolling. Ooh. To keep my final decal from looking lumpy, I sealed the leaf outlines with a layer of epoxy so I would have a nice smooth surface for my last decal. For my textured vinyl choice, I wanted to do, okay, so I love the rose gold, that's what this one is, but then I used the brown, oh, and I love the brown, but, I don't know, I think I'm leaning more towards the rose gold. Which one do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Now y'all are probably thinking that I am done, no more glitter needed. <laughs> yeah. You don't have to, of course, but y'all already know. Make sure your tumbler is nice and smooth and then you'll be all done. That's it guys! Thank you so much for watching my tutorial. A huge thank you to all of my Patreon and channel members. Your support is literally everything. Have fun making your neutral falling leaves peekaboo tumbler and I'll see you again next time.